Big Mystery Sports 7 here. Welcome back. We are playing Horizon Zero Dawn. I'm pretty sure we're close to the end game. Uh, we're not quite there yet, obviously. There's going to be a lot more crazy stuff that happens uh, as far as ending story climacticness. But we're close. <laughs> Eleven counting Gaia. Don't count your chicken embryos before they're incubated, hon. She's still firing up. Be a while before you eat that omelet. I'm vegan, Travis. You think we worked foot. the same secret base long enough for you to notice? <laughs> we weren't scheduled to shack up here for another three weeks. You realize I just lost 350 kilos of pre-code smug Thomas in transit. Wait, actual physical media? Why didn't you have it digitized? Can't beat the feel of physical media on your fingers. Yeah. And here we ain't gonna be touching a whole lot else. True. I, I was gonna pass the time archiving them. What about you? Me? At work, I guess. My task queue stretches out for like three years. There's a lot of sharp edges to round off. After that, I hadn't really thought about it. Huh. You will. Do what? Thirty. Can you be the one turning the lights off at the end? Food for thought, huh, vegan? This sucks forever. Nah, not forever. Just the rest of your life. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, hang on, hang on, hang on. Let me do a quick check just to make sure. Okay, so we repel down into the ruins. Turn left and walk north. Aha, our objective is that way. We want to go this way first. There's a blue room right here. And into it we go, and I believe, if I am not mistaken, that in the back of this room... <gasps> the power cell! Okay. Now, what we need to do is go and do that before we go any further in here. I don't know if it's going to allow me to just bounce out of here. My my concern yes it is brilliant very good. Okay. The pain, of course, will be getting back to where I was. I will do that part off screen. I really am looking forward to getting this new armor, uh, which we're going to go do before we do anything else. Now that I have all three of the power cells, I'm going to do this on screen so you can see what it is and what it does. I don't even know what it does yet. Apparently, it's, it looks pretty freaking rad. So. We shall see. Once it loads. I need to get some food. Actually, what I, what I think I'm going to do at this point is go, of course, get the armor. Because that's, you know, what you do when you can. And then from there, I'm going to go do, once I get that, I'm going to go do all of the side quests. I don't think I'll record most of them because I want some personal, like, non-recorded time with the game, which I think is, is important for my sanity. Uh, I've had a bunch of it, to be fair, but, you know, I don't need to record every part of the game. 
Just most of them. Let's see where. Itchy nose. Okay. Okay, cool. I thought that was going to kill me, but it did not. So we're good. Not a fish. The fish down here. No. I thought briefly that there would be, but there are not. Okay. So you find the first two, and it says, hey, do something with the power cells. You put them over here. Figure out the code, input the code, and it opens this door, which shows this freaking amazing looking armor. It looks freaking rad. I'm so excited for it. I'm going to go put these power cells in. Oh, yes. Oh, freaking yes. Hell to the yeah. Okay. Now to get the dials in position. There must be some kind of code. Ninety two seventy three sixty four fifty thirty. Okay. Or I'm sorry, uh six thirty. So assuming that this is angles ninety degrees, and we'll kind of assume that it's going Clockwise, 90 degrees would be right. 270 would be left. 360 would be at the top, again. 450 is a 90 degree uh, angle, so we'll have that pointing down. And then the 630 is a further one... 80 from that, so it would be facing up. Boo. No, that's 720. What am I doing? It's 90. 90 from 360, so it would be right there, and then another 180 from that would be right there. <gasps> Let's have a look at that armor and see oh yeah! All right, now let see what we can do with this material. Freaking exciting! Oh my gosh. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Hell yeah. Okay, gotcha. Fair enough. So, yeah. Shield Weaver outfit. Projects a damage absorbing force shield. It takes time to recharge when depleted. Freaking rad! It's so dope. Okay. I have an overshield. Oh my goodness. <laughs> that is so cool. Overshield for the win. Very, very nice. Didn't know what it did. I'm so glad I got it because it's dope. Uh, we're gonna do. We're gonna hold off on that. I think actually, and we're gonna do this one because why not? 
cannot fast travel without your shadow stalwart disguise equipped. Oh, fair play. Because they're kind of angsty pants. Uh, they don't care much for me at the moment. You know. Oh, boo. I gotta reset that. Dang on it. It's like halfway through, so that's fine. Halfway through, halfway through, halfway through. Ah, <laughs> uh, my dear, my dear. How we doing, Internet? We doing good? Excelsior. I need to manually save that, please. Yes. Now. Oh, okay. Oh. Cool. Oh, All right, I'll take a look at that in a minute. The shield. Shield makes everything better. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. I need to get this healing stuff. I don't think I actually have. Uh, Wrong way for sure. Shadow stalwart disguise. I can't do that quest yet. Okay. That's not inherently bad, I guess. Alright, where do you get one of those? Okay. You can do that. Alright. Now, technically, we're a little bit on the shorter side of this one, but no, like I'm actually kind of running a little bit longer than 15 this time around, so um, I'm actually at a really nice point of being able to stop it and go ahead and uh, do some side stuff, finish up a few side things, and then we will be ready to go to continue into Gaia. Now, I'll get into Gaia and kind of get back to where I was before I started recording again. So, uh, until next time, Bumble Bituna, we'll see you next video.